I would say the most exciting thing is just the fact that we, uh, we're getting some of this work done. Uh, these courts have been here a long time and they're very, they were very functional, but they were showing wear. Um, even some recent work on the highway right out there as they, they uh, redid Hark Rider, there was a lot of heavy equipment utilized that uh, caused some cracking in our courts. So uh, I'm just really grateful that the college decided that even though this may not be a permanent placement for uh, our outdoor courts, it was important enough to go ahead while we're using them to have them look like, you know, Hendrix. And that's, as that, you know, we all know that means uh, everything is, is in good shape and kept that way. The steps are to first to come in and clean the courts. They have uh, pressure washed this entire facility to get everything off of the, the underlying surface. And then they've gone in and repaired it extensively. I mean, they have taken more care than I was expecting uh, even to the point of going around looking for any low spots on the court that might allow water to cool if we have rain. They repaired cracks and a couple of uh, pretty rough spots on this court right here. So, um, yeah, they've, and then we had a quart of uh, acrylic paint put over the surface when it was prepared, and then two quarts of this uh, playing surface. So it's going to be just like new. There's a filler material that is basically a mixture of cement and something else, and I don't remember what that is, but they, they went in and, and filled those in completely. None of them were just, they weren't real serious cracks. Some of them were probably uh, half inch to three quarters of an inch wide, but, uh, but we got all of those repaired, and then after they, they uh, repaired that with that repair surface, which would be basically cement uh, and a mixture of, of another chemical, uh, then it's just a matter of buffing it down so that it's going to be will have a seamless appearance on the court when they get the surface on. In the years I've been here, I've seen a, a tremendous growth in the interest in tennis. And, um, and of course, th this population is growing pretty rapidly. And it's, it's, um, the demographics of Conway are just right for a sport like uh, for tennis. But our situation has, has led a lot of people to have to play their tennis in Little Rock. So we've, we've been helping support the facilities at Burns Park in North Little Rock and the Little Rock Racquet Club and the Little Rock Athletic Club. So uh, I just know that when the time comes that we have really top-rate facilities here in Conway that we're going to pull all that back.